talking to that? I'm not weird. You're wi you're 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 no, you're cool. You're cool. You're cause you're watching. You're pretty cool. Watch this. 10 million diamond play button flip. Yay! Oh! I'm the first one to ever do that, probably. Actually, I don't know about that. What about this? Double diamond play button flip. Yay! Oh! God, that's hard. That's what she said. <laughs> and I kind of hurt my freaking wrist. This thing is heavier than you think, all right? Don't, ah, don't make fun of me. This is the freaking best. Anyways, guys, let's get right into the video. We're going to be looking at the rarest genetic disorders that you probably won't believe exist. Like this one, guys. This is insane. So this guy has eight fingers on one hand. You're probably used to five, right? Well, this guy's got three extra. Three extra fingers, guys. That'd be kind of cool. I'm not gonna lie, that'd be pretty cool having three extra fingers. I feel like this guy could probably hold something mass. He could probably hold like, I don't know. He could probably lift like a hundred pounds really simply, right? Well, I guess if he's if he's strong enough. He probably could, like, I don't know. He could probably grab something really, really, really big and like lift it pretty easily. Eight fingers? Like, imagine the power with eight fingers. I don't know. This is crazy. But yeah, this is a genetic disorder. As you can tell, like right here, look at that. It looks like he has like double everything pretty much. He doesn't have 10 fingers on one hand, but almost. It looks like if you cut this in half, it would be two hands, right? Like right down the middle, but they're, they're just missing thumbs. And that's exactly what it is. Like, this guy does not have a thumb. This is one of his hands, guys, is this. No thumbs. It's just like this. Uh, that is the craziest thing to me, dude. I don't know what this is called, but it's very, very rare. This guy has eight fingers on one hand. I don't know if his other hand has eight fingers as well. It probably has five, and then he's got eight on one hand. So this guy's got 13 fingers, man. That's freaking crazy. But yeah, let's get right in the video, guys. That is exactly what we're gonna be looking at. Rare genetics. Man Make sure you subscribe to the channel. My name's Kalos, if you didn't know, by the way. I do have an Instagram. Boom, look at that picture. Pretty nice, right? <laughs> I post dope pictures. So go follow me. Road to 500K. Go follow me. Appreciate it. Let's get right into the video. So this family was born with very, very strong hormones. All three of these humans are girls. It's actually crazy to me that these are girls. This girl has a full beard. Bigger beard than me. I don't even really have a beard. And I'm kind of jealous of this girl because they have a bigger beard than me. And that is just making me look bad, man. Like, come on. I never thought I would be jealous of a girl's beard. Their noses even have hair on them. That is how hairy these girls are. So this baby right here only has one eye. This is a super, super rare genetic genetic disorder guys and I don't know what this is exactly I think it might be their nose but I don't know that just wouldn't really make sense because look as you can tell there's no nose right here they do have a mouth no nose and then one eye right here but why is this here I don't know what happened but it, for some reason their eyes and nose switched I'm guessing and then they were only born with one eye I don't know if you guys have ever heard of Cyclops but this is kind of like what this is pretty much is like a one-eyed baby. I actually just visited the uh, Ripley's Believe It or Not Museum in LA and they had a Cyclops goat <laughs> there. So it's definitely a thing. It's just a disorder. But yeah, this is one of the craziest things I've seen. A baby with one eye. So this boy actually has something that is called ocular albinism. I think that's how you pronounce it. Nope. As you can see, his eyes are very, very blue. It's actually kind of gorgeous. I'm not gonna lie. I'm kind of jealous. But the reason why his eyes look so blue and like they're so cool looking is because there's actually no pigment in the iris. Ocular albinism is a rare genetic condition affects only the eyes, causing pigment to disappear. I don't really know if this affects their vision at all. It does not tell me that, but it looks really cool. I'm not gonna lie. This looks amazing. So if you have brown eyes like me and your future wife or husband has brown eyes, a baby can be born with ocular albinism and actually be born with blue eyes. Wow. Pretty rare, but yeah, it definitely can happen. Okay. Okay, so you remember that picture who had three extra fingers? Well, this guy only has three fingers. This looks so interesting. Only having three fingers. This kind of reminds me of like a lizard or like what are those things? Like, I'm pretty sure it's a lizard where they only have like those three fingers or like a chicken. It kind of reminds me of chicken. Like I'm not trying to be mean or anything, but this is kind of what it reminds me of. It's like chicken paws or ch 
chicken legs. What are they called? Chicken feet? Chicken feet? Yeah. I don't think I've ever seen anything like this before in my life. A person with three fingers, and it looks totally real. There's no scars, no nothing. It literally just goes right down into his thumb. That is just the craziest thing to me. Three fingers, man. Whoa. I don't know if his other hand has three fingers too. Could be like an eight finger guy like this, maybe, you know, eight fingers, or it could be six fingers. Could be like that. The other guy had 13 fingers. This guy might have eight fingers, might have six fingers. Who knows, dude? Anything's possible. If you only had one option, guys, to be born with hands with three fingers on them or eight fingers on them, which one would you want? Let me know. That's a pretty interesting question, but yeah, let me know in the comments. So this is one of the craziest things I've seen. Look at this tongue. So this guy has tentacles on his tongue. Yeah, you'd probably never seen something like that. This is the craziest thing, guys. If you look at my tongue, I can't talk with my tongue out. I just realized. But yeah, I don't have tentacles on my tongue. But this guy actually was born with tentacles on the bottom of his tongue. They look spiky too. It's very interesting. But some people actually have some cases where it's a warning of serious disease if this is actually happening on your tongue. But also it could be benign. But yeah, very, very interesting. Very, very rare. So this girl, you may know her, but she's kind of like a famous Instagram girl. Her name is Winnie Harlow. This is not makeup, guys. This is actually what her skin looks like. It's called vitiligo or vit vitiligo. I'm sorry if I mispronounced it, but yeah. She doesn't have pigment in her skin in certain places. Right around her mouth, she doesn't. Like, as you can see, kind of around her eyes and everything. Very, very interesting to me. She kind of rocks it. I actually have heard of this disorder from her, actually, because I've seen her on Instagram. But yeah, I really like how she doesn't use makeup to, like, you know, make it go away. Like, she could use makeup and, like, cover it up, but she doesn't. She's just like, I'm born this way. Might as well freaking show the world. I like that. Pretty cool. So yeah, vitiligo. Bit of Lyco, I don't know. Ah. So this, I think, is one of the coolest looking things. I actually have a friend who actually has two different colored eyes. It's not the same eye that has two different colors, but this one's actually the same eye that's two different colors, which I think is really cool, actually. If you don't like having brown eyes, well, then you can have blue. You can have both. Why not? I wish I had blue eyes, but I have brown eyes. This person has both. <laughs> kind of jealous, not gonna lie. So this rare genetic condition is called sectoral heterochromia. So this is apparently due to the the mutation of the genes that determine the melanin distribution in your eye. Very rare. I don't think I've ever met someone who actually has two different colors in one eye. That's super cool, dude. Sectoral hetero. Romeo. Very, very rare condition. Okay, so this is probably one of the craziest conditions, but basically it just looks like she has lumps all over her face, and this actually covers her whole body as well. I can't imagine living with this. So this condition is called neurofibromatosis. It's a genetic disorder of the nervous system. It causes a bunch of tumors to grow on your nerves. So yeah, this lady has it, and this is, this is how it looks like. I've never heard of neuro fibromatosis before making this video, but yeah, this is super, super interesting. It's crazy just to see like this on somebody, but I'm glad to see that she's, you know, smiling, having a good time, but yeah, very, very rare genetic condition. So this is probably the coolest one yet. This is insane, but this guy has only freckles on one side of his face, almost split perfectly down the middle. I think this is insane. I got freckles. Can you guys see my freckles? Look at that. Boom. Boom, the freaking everywhere. I got freckles, ah. Do you guys got freckles? Let me know. Are you a part of the freckle gang? Hashtag freckle gang. This is actually not a genetic condition. Apparently this is like a birthmark that you can have, I guess, where you're born with freckles on only one side of your face. Very, very rare though. So this guy has what is called the Wardenburg syndrome. And it causes you to actually have two different colored eyes and apparently growing different colored hair as well. As you can see, his mustache is half white, half brown, and his hair is kind of like brown and white. Very, very interesting. Kind of cool looking. I'm not gonna lie, this kind of looks good. I'm reading here, it says people with this condition are also often deaf. I wonder why that is. That is very interesting. But yeah, Wardenburg syndrome. Okay, this has got to be one of the most insane conditions yet. I don't know what this is called, guys. I don't even know if this is a real picture, but I found this online. This is insane. I think it's real. I actually do think it's real. But this girl was born with no nose and cat eyes. I don't know, guys. I don't know 
know if this is real, but it's crazy. She's got really sharp teeth. Let me know in the comments if you guys know what this condition is called. I've looked it up and I can't find anything on it. But yeah, pretty crazy, guys. This is an insane picture. But yeah, guys, that is it for the video. If you did enjoy and if you learned something, make sure to smash that like button. Subscribe if you're new. Turn on those notifications, guys. I will see you guys all in another video. Bye.